Good morning, children. Welcome to Sunday School. Let us pray. Our Father in heaven, open our lips to praise you. Help us know your word so that it will grow in our hearts. We pray through our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Exodus chapter 16 verse 1 to 18 Mana and Quail In the desert, the whole community grumbled against Moses and Aaron. They said, If only we had died by the Lord's hand in Egypt. There we sat around pots of meat and ate all the food we wanted. But you have brought us out into this desert to starve this entire assembly to death. The Lord heard the people's grumbles, so he told Moses, I will rain down bread for he from heaven for you. Tell them, at twilight you will eat meat, and in the morning you will be filled with bread. Then you will know that I am the Lord your God. The Lord wanted to test if the people will follow his instructions. That evening, quail came and covered the camp so people were able to eat meat. In the morning, bread, also known as manna, appeared on the ground. The Lord had commanded that no one was to keep any of it until the next morning. However, some of them didn't listen and they kept the manna, and the manna was full of maggots the next morning. The Lord also commanded them to gather twice as much on the sixth day as the people are not allowed to gather manna on the day of Sabbath rest. So they saved it until the next morning, and it did not stink or get maggots in it. Again, some didn't listen and could not find any manna on the seventh day. From the story, we learn that number one, the Lord always keeps His promise. He provided for the people even though they grumbled against Him. Number two, listen and obey God's command. Number three, God wants us to rest on seventh day and use this day to spend time with Him so that we will not lose sight of Him. Psalm 150 verse 6 Let's read together Let everything that has breath praise the Lord Praise the Lord Let's say that one more time Let everything that has breath praise the Lord Praise the Lord Let us pray Our Father in heaven May your name be honoured. We thank you for our parents who work hard to care for us. We thank you for our wonderful friends and classmates. We thank you for your care. Amen. Happy Children's Day!